Do you know how to write the equation of a line if you've been given the slope and a point on that line? Let's take a look at how to do this. First, let's say that you know the slope of the line is equal to positive 3 and that a point on that line is 4, 7. Can you write the equation for this line? Well, first, let's use slope-intercept form. That's the easiest way to begin. y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. We know the slope, so we can say y equals 3x plus b. We don't know b. This is what's missing. We do know x and y, because here's an x value and here's a y value. Let's substitute 4 in for x and 7 in for y. We have 7 equals 3 times 4 plus our unknown, which is b. 7 equals 3 times 4 plus b. Now we have, now we have a problem we can solve. Bring down the 7. 3 times 4 is equal to 12 plus b. We're solving for b, so we want to get b alone. Let's subtract 12 from both sides. These cancel. 7 minus 12 is negative 5. Negative 5 is our y-intercept of b. Now we can write our equation. y equals 3x minus 5. Now we have an equation for our line. Let's take a look at another one. Can you write the equation of a line that has a slope of negative 2 and a point on that line is negative 1, 5. Once again, let's start by using the slope-intercept form. y equals mx plus b. y equals, we substitute in negative 2 for slope, x plus b. Again, we're going to look for b. We need to solve for the y-intercept. We have an x value and we have a y value. So we have 5 equals negative 2 times a negative 1 plus b. 5 equals negative 2 times negative 1 is a positive 2 plus b. Let's move that here. 5 equals 2 plus b. We want to get b alone. We subtract 2 from both sides. These cancel, and we end up with 3 is equal to b. Now let's write our equation in slope-intercept form. y is equal to negative 2x plus 3. Here's the equation for our line.